The Bright Spot, sponsored by Connecticut Lighting Centers. It is time now for The Bright Spot. We need it. Your daily dose of uplifting positive stories. Channel 3's Nicole Nalepa shows us that hearts around our state are only growing in support of those on the front lines. Chances are, if you take a look around your neighborhood, your town, there are more and more signs of love and appreciation. Bristol, nicknamed the All Heart City, has been busy spreading the love. Public school students have been challenged to help color and hang their hearts on their front windows as a way to lift spirits. In addition to the hearts, Nico, a kindergartner, and his little sister Maya made handprint rainbows that are sure to brighten any day, rain or shine. Down on the shoreline, Old Saybrook is helping paint the town red after announcing a special contest. They're encouraging residents to dress up their front door by using whatever materials they can find at home. And many participants are taking it a step further and dedicating their designs to essential workers. Over in Niantic, a local sign business is literally using their resources to help raise money for those who could use a little assistance right now. Signcraft started selling these hearts at $10 a piece. $2 from every sale has been going directly to Karen Cherub East Lime, which provides food, financial, and emergency support to families in that area. And then we continue to receive photos like these, where messages from the heart are written out on whiteboards like this one. I wish to be with you soon. These are just a few of the sentiments residents at Middlesex Healthcare Center in Middletown shared since visitor restrictions went into effect at the nursing home. But many, like Cheryl, are not letting the current situation dim their sunshine. With today's Bright Spot, I'm Nicole Nalepa.